Oh, yeah, see, we're up on the roof. So we can sneak in. Excellent. They ship them in from the farm to purchase bastard daughters. And the extra mouths that can't be fed. Yeah, the heart has a couple extra lines here. They thought they would be working in the factory. By the time they arrived, it's much too late. The plague swept through here. There are rooms they have yet to clean. The girls do not like this new lab. She is not kind. Not at all like the old one. The golden cat entertains important clients tonight. The madam is worried. She is not. I'm shocked to discover that the prostitution business in Dunwall is not entirely ethical. Is, is there ever... Like, I have... Like, I, I mean, I don't look into it a lot, but never in my life have I ever been, like, heard. Yeah, I'm a whore, but it's, it's really cool. It's nice. Sorry, lady. I'm on duty. I'm on duty, too. Want me to show you? You want me to lose my job? Get lost. Excuse me. Just trying to make a living. Yeah, there's quite a few guards here. Mm. Like I said, the, the Pendletons hang out here a lot, and they're... I told, you. told her to keep the children inside. I don't suppose you're, uh not going to not murder these people. Well, I'm not going to murder the, the I'm not going to murder the prostitutes. Think they'll get your own squad after what happened last week? I say we <laughs> back then. Well. There's no proof. You're playing the exact opposite game my friend played. What he he spared the armed guards and killed the unarmed hookers? Yeah, he no, he he does that in pretty much every game. He goes after the prostitutes. Really? Don't worry about him. That that's tr that's troubling. Even I'm not going to lie to you, Nick. What do we do? <laughs> Send we worry about him. Burn the whole country down. That it show me. No. Can you? A frank you discussion know? of foreign policy in done in the, in the world of the empire. Yeah. See, yes, I, I hate to disappoint anyone who thought that this would be you know a special prostitute prostitute targeting run of Dishonored. It's not. My friend will be displeased. Yeah, he doesn't watch these, so he won't know. That's, that's just as well. I'm not sure I really want that demographic in our audience. It's not a great one. <laughs> it's not where you want your ad revenue coming from. Misogynistic psychopaths, 18 to 35. <laughs> I can't remember, but some... The vi exact video. But there was some... Um, I think it might have been an ad for, like, was it Barbies or some, something? No, it wasn't Barbie, because it was something that, like, men have absolutely zero use for. But the YouTube demographics for the ad was, like, the first, the top three were all men of different ages. Huh. I think it was, like, Tampax or something. Okay. I can't remember. And men were flocking to see this Tampax commercial? Apparently. That was the top demographic. Smooth yeah. editing. Oh, yeah. Seamless. <laughs> if you hadn't pointed that out, no one would have ever known. <laughs> yeah. I can't, I can't emphasize, overemphasize enough. I am not that good in this game, and the fact that you don't see me die that often is not because I wasn't dying often. Ah, here we go. I met many a death trying to do the, the falling stealth kill. Because if you try to do that from a high high level and you miss, you're just fucked. Hmm. Is there like a Banksy here? I keep seeing all these graffitis. And who has the free time and the money? <sighs> that was a rare case of me poison. I think just because I didn't want to make noise, I don't remember. But yeah. So is he asleep or is he? He's asleep. Yeah. Okay. Actually asleep, not in the euphemistic sense. Oop. 
Golden Cat's quite a big place. It's just this is a, cl a customer, I assume. Just smoking and looking at that sign. And this is another area where you really, it's cool, you really have a lot of freedom to go in different ways, take different approaches. There's the madam. I'll leave the rest to your imagination. Custis is easier to manage. Some nights he just waits in the smoking room upstairs and says, please, money will do you a favor. Now, it, it varies. I'm not sure if it's according to difficulty level or chaos level or if it's just purely random. But the first time I played through this, it was actually different. One of them was in the basement, in the, uh, like, the... Uh, oh! I, I I hit him so hard, he clipped right through the table there. Tearing his internal organs asunder. But, yeah, sometimes one of the brothers will be downstairs in, like, the uh, steam baths. Oh. Interesting. And if he is, there's actually an alternate way you can take him out without, uh... I mean, you still kill him, but you don't actually have to even, uh, uh get into the same room with him. I'll, sh I'll show it to you. He it doesn't get him, but I'll sh I do show it later. Mm. Oh, I was just going to make a note that she says one of the brothers is in the ivory room, which is heavily soundproofed. soundproofed. And, uh... You know, makes no comments there. But that the other brother is just talking in the smoking room. And if you go actually and then look, the the brother in the smoking room is actually the one having sex with a prostitute, and the other one in the ivory room is talking politics. Well, that's right. Yeah, one of them is apparently just talking. It's weird. Well, maybe she... I don't know how she could mix the two up. I mean, they're they're they're, they're two such completely distinct and fully realized characters. <laughs> Not at all using the same character model. Heavens no. Oh wait, who's that? Wait, that's actually not. Just a prostitute. No bread or prostitutes. And I do the no I do the non-lethal for the prostitutes because. Like I said, my, my policy in this is that, for the most part, and aside from assassination targets, I don't kill people who aren't armed. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, this is actually from, like, like, uh, like, it's a actually from, like, a de detective novel or something about some guy's w sister going missing. And he writes about a real place. Pretty ballsy. Well, what are they going to say? No, we're not a bordello? What? Oh! What, what, about the, what, what if that lady was doing with a rune? Yeah, all that knocking out that prostitute sure made you hungry. Oh, yeah, it builds an appetite. Do you know how many different muscles are involved in putting your arm across someone's throat and squeezing, Nick? It's a lot. Wait, who's this? Is it another prostitute? Shame on you, Nick. No, it's Emily. She's eight years old, for God's sake. <laughs> Remember, she was being held here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, depending on which way you go in through, you can find her really early. They told her her mother had her head chopped off? I think he just meant dead like mother. Oh. Alright. It's this way. Alrighty. Lead the way, tiny child. 
you scout ahead for me and she's a mission critical NPC cause she, so can she die I don't know it's a good question I don't I never tested it she's also a child which I know Bethesda has a history of not letting you kill right it's a good question well she she can die in the high chaos version of the last mission she can fall although that's by falling to her doom <sighs> yeah so it's like trying to get away. Now she takes the key with her. You've got to find the key so we can leave. Uh, hey, down my cheese! I'll hide here until you get the key. This pushy. Just move out of the way. Hey, just elixir for the... for the employees here. Now, you may recall Piero said that he designed some sort of unspecified device used in this place. Yes. I'm still going with my whale oil-powered, steam-fueled Sibian idea. Sibian. <laughs> it's like this big boiler that men are, like, feeding coal into. Constantly. Black smoke billowing out. Did you hear what that little girl said? Whoop. No. She's cute. Amy or Emily or something. She tried to escape. Somehow she found the VIP exit. Really? Yes, Prudence keeps it locked now, and she carries the only key. Why is she here anyway? Is she some niece of the Pendletons? No idea. They keep her hidden away. Hmm. Luckily, I have plenty of sleep darts. You'll be fine. <laughs> Although I would not want to be sprawled on this floor. Yeah. So you're just going to put her on the table? Well, sort of. As best you can. She's... Up we go. Now, if you, like throw them really far, like, say, off a building, will they die? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, un yeah. unconscious people can still die. Also, like, if you leave them lying in, in water. Yeah, I remember doing that in, um, uh, Deus Ex. Okay, or if the rats get them. So if you're in a high rat area, you don't want to leave people just lying around. Master key needed. A lot of times when there's just like a place where there's just like a, a lone rat hanging out, that's usually a sign that somewhere there's a, uh, like a hole that you could use possession to sneak into. Hmm. Some serums. Is that a bathroom? I don't know. In a, cr a creepy room in a plague-ridden bordello? No. <laughs> I'm disappointed in the golden cat. <laughs> I thought it was going to be high class everywhere. Anyway, nice. nice, tastefully decorated lobby. Not bad. Yoink. Here's some stuff about dealing with plague, the symptoms of the plague and dealing with them. Guest ledger. Ah, Mr. Bunting with Betty in the silver room. Hmm. Violetta in the smoking room. Only three people in this. Remember, there is no sex in the champagne room, Nick. Right. Gold root. I don't know who those people are. I want to say they'd be madams, but there are way too many of them. Yeah, this place would have to have been here a long, long time.
Maybe they've just got a. F maybe they've just got like. Maybe they've just got like a little photo booth somewhere, and people take their pictures there. C c you know, commemorate your visit to the bordello. <laughs> That's a good word, bordello. It is. <laughs>